Hi, my name's Phil Bethel and I'm an archaeologist. I've been an archaeologist since I was about 12, I guess. And a friend of my parents took me on an excavation and it turned out to be a Roman villa excavation. And there it was, I found my first pieces of pottery, my first coin, my first bones. It's absolutely amazing, the sense of discovery buried in the soil. And I've been hooked on it ever since. That was my introduction. That's what I've done in my career since then. I've done quite a lot of different things in archaeology. I've been a digger, I've been on excavations all over the world, in the UK of course, in Oman, in Cyprus, in Germany, in Abu Dhabi. I've dug on lots of different types of sites from very deeply stratified um, city urban deposits to very shallow rural sites where there's hardly any traces of archaeology and you're really hard pressed to find those bits of evidence. I think my favourite was the Sutton Hoo excavation where we worked in the Anglo-Saxon Mound Cemetery and there I was uncovering the sand bodies that we found there where the, the bodies had decayed in the very acid sand to just a just a staining in the soil and that was a real test of your skills of excavation to separate out the very fine different colorations in, in what was just sand and be able to recreate the shapes of the of the Anglo-Saxon bodies that have been buried there. I've also been an archaeological scientist. I worked in a laboratory analysing soils for traces of, of the molecules that survive from the human gut when they've been excreted in the faeces and they can survive for thousands of years in the soil and can be recovered in minute traces through, uh, through chemical and, uh, analysis. So I've also been a, a museum archaeologist and I ran a Roman villa site open to the public for many years and that brought me into contact with many different audiences, lots of different people from, from learned professors to uh, school children to families to students, all sorts of different people from all over the world came and, and as my task, one of my, part of my job was to explain the, the archaeology to them, to explain what they were looking at in terms of the remains and, and the story behind them. I've also done a, a, a few bits of media work, I've appeared in a number of, of shows, TV archaeology shows, done a number of pieces to camera, but mainly about Roman Britain, because when a number of series were being made about Roman Britain, they came to the Roman villa that, where I worked, and I was asked to talk about the mosaics or about particular discoveries that have been made there, and I really enjoyed doing that. I've also done a bit of radio, which I, I also particularly enjoyed. But what is it about archaeology that really excites me? Well, it's about people. For me, archaeology is getting in touch with people in the past and the getting close to their lives, understanding their stories, even though the evidence for that is really often very fragmented and often very difficult to piece together. But that's the excitement, that's the puzzle of archaeology, that's the thrill of it, is solving that puzzle and uh, showing light, shedding light on the stories of people in the past.